Welcome to Porto do Carmen, Old Town. Some views up here is hilly, but when you get up here, you might say the views are worth it if you're staying in one of the hotels. The rooms overlooking the pool at the Flora Hotel are fantastic. I've done a wee video there. Unfortunately, I didn't have that room. I was across the road. I'm just uh, heading to my next hotel, which is going to be in the new town. I think it's called the La Morena Apartments. It's the cheapest I could get on a Saturday night. It's quite busy in there. It's called Kalima. Be happy. Let's head down to me. Uh, the cheapest I could get on a Saturday night, £72. A bit more than I'd like to pay. And then tomorrow, you might have seen it by now, I'm in Player Blanket at the... Is it a THB or TBH? I get, I get mixed up with the initials. The Royal Hotel, part of the same group as the Flora. And I'm in there for £61 bed and breakfast, which seems not bad. They say it's a four star, but I don't know if it is. I'll check it out. It was £55 for room only, and it was £6 for breakfast. Now, I'm not really first for the breakfast in the morning, to be honest with you. Um, really have early morning breakfast when I'm in the Canaries, but for £6 I'll film the breakfast for you and hopefully the video will get a few views, it'll be cost effective for the channel and you get to see what the breakfast is like in the Royal Hotel Playa Blanca it's a win-win so I've put on the Google Maps on my other phone and it's telling me it's a 20 minute walk to this um, accommodation so we'll see, I might take a left down here, I might go through the old town, we'll just wait and see there is the purple turtle I'm on my wee pocket Osmo, so unfortunately I don't have my glasses on, so I'm struggling to see the screen. There's the opening hours there for you as well. Ice cold San Miguel, always a warm welcome. Sounds good to me. Now, it's very surprisingly, there's a wee nightclub down here. I passed here last night, it was about one in the morning, half one, heading back up to my hotel, and this wee nightclub is open. I'm surprised there's, there's enough young people about in this area to go to a nightclub. If you're looking for a, a really good rock band, the Island Bar. Is a place to be down here. They've got a proper band on the stage. I just popped in for one drink and then at the end last night I met the guys again, uh, Graham and Ian and the girls from Paisley. They were in there having a wee drink as well before heading home. So good to see you again guys. Let's head down this way. Uh, it's getting very warm now. It's approaching midday. It's about 25 degrees I would say. Quite windy. We'll see if the wind uh, how much wind gets picked up. I'm on this wee DJI Pocket Osmo 2 because I'm carrying the rucksack in my other hand so it's a lot easier to use this wee camera. I quite like this wee camera actually. The only thing is I can't see the screen much. I don't have my glasses on. They've got entertainment in there as well. The wee restaurant. I think I passed the nightclub. I might, might come down to it down here. Brennan's down here, doesn't open till later on. That place there is doing breakfast, looks quite nice actually, smells quite nice. Got a wee boutique clothes shop in there, lovely. Look, Kelly's open later on as well. Brennan's is a sun trap. Later on, when this is open, all the tables will be in the sun. Look at the views, eh? I've done a wee video last night coming from the hotel, but I thought I would actually show you what it was like during the day. The views are fantastic up here. No, no, no. Steep hill, but it's not for the faint-hearted. Yeah. I've done a wee video in Tenerife showing you that walk and lost Chris Janis. This is on a par, probably the hill here. Maybe not quite as steep at the end. We'll see. Two nice wee side streets here. Guys, exhausted about the bloat, but that's for sure. There's a wee cafe there. It's a called Head Shop. For all the guys like smoke, a wee cafe there as well. If you're coming here, Foxy's Bar. You barbers there on the left hand side. You need to be haircut. Now I didn't realise when I filmed the video the other night um, This bar around the corner on the left used to be a Witherspoon's, it's changed to a Celtic bar That's a Hogan Stand, Irish sports bar It's been there for years hasn't it? Sally Jones, live horse racing as well 
eight large TVs. Oh, look. Got it on already. Passed it last night, actually. Um, looks like a wee sports bar. It was busy last night when I passed it. Early days, mind you, it's not even 12 o'clock yet, so all these bars will not be busy. Now, I need to make a decision here. Do I go left or do I go down to the old town do a wee video? If I go left, I'm going to save myself at least five minutes walking. So I don't know. I'm tempted to do that. I'll wait and see. There's a wee kind of shop centre with a bar in it over there, but it's not got much in it. That's the wee tr traditional Spanish bar we're talking about there with the green door. And then next to it, it's where Witherspoons used to be, not actually Witherspoons, but you know, it's called Witherspoons. It's now called the Boys Bar, so it's got a Celtic bar, obviously, it's got a Scotland flag up there as well, but it's mostly going to attract, I'd imagine, Celtic fans or Scottish viewers. Up there is a piece of fear, a shopping centre, you can get the bus up there to play a banker. I'm not sure where I'm going to get the bus uh, in Porto do Carmen, I think you can get it from the main strip. So at this point, I need to make a decision. Go left or go right. I think I'll go right just in case I'm not back down this way. I'll take a wee video in Port uh, Porto do Carmen Old Town during the day just in case I don't make it back here. There's a wee locals bar in there. All the wee shops in there. And apparently, this wee shopping centre across here just was really, really busy. I think obviously during uh, lockdown and everything, just places just shut and it's never quite recovered, but it does still have quite a well-known Irish bar in there. We can cut down this way as well. Beauty salon. Let's cross over. So you can see how steep that hill is that I've came from. So bear that in mind, if you are going to stay at the Flora, there's one next to it, a boutique hotel, it's beautiful inside, um, is it called Isle or something? I've done a wee video on it before, um, it looks beautiful inside, the pool overlooks the sea, really nice. So we wander across here will we? I'm going to go down that way probably, see how busy it is at midday in the old town. Look at the drink steals here eh, 250 for a large beer, Amstel, Tropical. Not a big fan of Tropical, I can drink it, but I'm not a big fan of it. Guinness 450, that's not bad. The bottles of beer, 2 euros. It's pretty cheap. Sports and karaoke bar. In here on the right hand side. Half hour. Oh, that's a half hour price all day. So half past nine. They do food in here as well. Irish Rover there on the left hand side, I don't know when that opens. And up the top, they did have cocktail bars and stuff up the top, I don't know if they're open now. Place looks as if it's not open, so really it looks as if in this place, the main bit that's open really is just this bar here. The jar is that a new place that's open, maybe. This is the wee sports bar here. Been here for many, many years. Got a big bar inside. Showing all the football, live sports, loads of uh, promotions here. Karaoke fans, it's on 10 to quarter to 3 in the morning, so that's a late night bar. I missed that last night actually when I was at the road. There was no bars open when I was at the road last night. Most of the bars. Round about the old town, as far as I can see, shut about one o'clock. So that one's open late, so I found you a late night bar. Nothing really to show you up there. I think there used to be another bar there called the Blarney Stone, so I think at one point this was quite thriving, this wee centre, but nowadays it's pretty quiet. ATM if you want a shocking exchange rate in there, you're desperate. Right, we're going to go down this way, I think. Probably could have got a bus as well. Give myself more walking to do. Uh, if you're new to the channel, hit the wee subscribe button, it's absolutely free, it doesn't cost a penny. And uh, 
check out all the other videos on the channel. I'm going to head down to the old town and see how busy it is. I'll do another wee video and let you know.